Hello friends, imagine you have an empty room just waiting to be transformed into a magical space. Who do you call to make it happen? An interior designer or an interior decorator? They both have unique skills and talents to create amazing spaces, but they approach their work in different ways. In this video, we will see differences between the two and also see who you should hire. So let us start. Scope of work Interior designers focus on both the aesthetic and functional aspects of a space. They have a broader scope of work, including spatial planning, architectural modifications, material selection, lighting design, and project management. On the other hand, interior decorators primarily focus on the aesthetics of a space. Their work involves selecting and arranging furniture, fabrics, colors, and decorative elements to create a visually pleasing environment. They often work on already constructed spaces and do not engage in structural modifications or architectural planning. Education and Training Interior designers usually have formal education and training in interior design or architecture. They often hold a bachelor's degree or higher and may be licensed or certified depending on the jurisdiction. Their training covers various aspects including design principles, spatial planning, building codes, and drafting skills. Whereas in case of interior decorators, formal education is not always required. Many pursue certificate programs or short-term courses to enhance their skills. They may also gain practical experience through internships or apprenticeships. Interior decorators primarily rely on their creative abilities and a keen eye for design. Problem solving and technical skills Due to their comprehensive training, interior designers possess strong problem solving skills. They analyze clients' needs, consider special constraints, and develop functional and efficient design solutions. They are often proficient in using design software, creating detailed drawings, and collaborating with architects and contractors. Whereas, interior decorators contribute to the visual aspects of a space and they do not typically engage in complex problem solving or technical tasks. Their skills lie in color coordination, furniture arrangement, and selection of decorative items to create a cohesive and aesthetically pleasing atmosphere. Professional Credentials Interior designers can obtain professional credentials such as registered interior designer or obtaining certification from organizations like National Council for Interior Design Qualification. These credentials often require a combination of education, experience and passing a standardized exam. On the other hand, professional certifications are less common for interior decorators. However, there are some organizations that offer certifications such as Certified Interior Decorators. Collaboration and Project Management Interior designers often work closely with architects, contractors and other professionals involved in a project. They are involved in the entire design process from conceptualization to completion. They coordinate and manage various aspects of the project, including budgeting, scheduling, and overseeing the construction and installation phases. Whereas interior decorators typically work directly with clients and focus on their specific design preferences. They collaborate with clients to understand their style preferences and budgetary constraints. Who you should hire? Who you should hire depends on your needs. If structural changes are needed, such as removing a wall, moving plumbing or wiring around, or adding new windows or doors, an interior designer is generally the better choice. On the other hand, if no structural changes are needed, but you need aesthetic help, deciding on a style, choosing wallpaper, paint, and furnishings, picking window treatments, and choosing lighting and accessories, 
an interior decorator will probably do the trick so friends see you in the next video thanks for watching